westbound on Addison here at the mobile. If you're making a left turn, we'll be going south on mobile here. Uh, there we go. Off oh, right off the bat, you got a, a sewer cave in, main sewer cave in right here at the intersection. Uh, going up to uh, the street here, I see a lot of landscaping uh, dealing going on in the parkway, which is illegal. You're not supposed to plant anything on the parkway, it's supposed to be flat. I mean, they could harbor the rats, hiding spot or something. Imagine walking down the street and all of a sudden a rat jumps out. It's just not good. All right, we're at Eddy Street. <coughs> we're going southbound on uh, at our uh, Mobile. Just crossed Eddy. And the street is wavy. Wavy means there's a lot of things going on underneath. It could be uh, the underlayment down there could be all screwed up. Uh, it's a good thing it's raining on it because everybody can see uh, all the sewer problems out here. Like right here at the corner, Cornelia and Mobile, I see uh, a lot of flooding going on there. That catch basement could be flooded. Again, these these catch basements and water and main water sewer uh, lines should be uh, cleaned out either with a vector or an orange peel. And there with the sewer department, those big yellow trucks that we all see coming on the street. That's what they need out here for these streets. All right, as I'm going down uh, Mobile here, we're passing Newport. Newport's got a lot of low-hanging branches. I'm going to have to swerve out over the way so my antenna doesn't hit the tree branches. Needs a lot of tree trimming here. Again, neglected area here. Uh, the streets need sweeping here. <coughs> Alleys look pretty flooded. That's, we'll cover that in another uh, program. Uh, coming up to Roscoe. Going down Roscoe here, a lot of evergreens on this uh, north uh, west side corner which is very bad I mean you know they should keep that <coughs> excuse me they should keep all that landscaping in their own properties there not on the corner because you can't see a car coming around the corner you know everything that's going to happen is you're going to get bigger and bigger and bigger and you won't be able to see nothing at all all right coming up to Henderson still on mobile going south got to let this car in front of me here another bad thing about the this island in the middle is bad for traffic also. Okay, we're uh, well, trees hanging down again, low cut hanging branches. My antenna will probably hit that. Yeah. That's how low the branches are. Alright, another interesting point here. I don't know what the street is at because there's no signage of what street this is. It's a very bad because if you get people from out of out of town and you're giving them directions and they're traveling down mobile, they won't know to turn it. They could keep going and keep going all the way until the park over there. Uh, but anyway, we're still going down on mobile here. A lot of potholes in the street. A lot of landscaping going on. Local hanging branches all over the place. This ward has not been uh, serviced with uh, tree service. Okay, this street here is Melrose. I'm crossing over Melrose on Mobile. I see there's another sewer plugged up over here in front of 3222 North Mobile. And a lot of potholes. Lots of potholes. Right now I'm going to be crossing over Belmont to Ferry. A lot of potholes. I don't know if you can tell by that water bottle I got on my dashboard how rough that pothole with that. Uh, a lot of people are scared to drive. This guy almost hit me in the side over here as I'm waiting here. Uh, we're going uh, to wait for traffic to go by. Seems like a lot of traffic right now. Uh, these curbs, they got a lot of water in the curbs. So if you have any senior citizens walking down the street or children, you know, you don't want the wet there. The feet will stay wet and that's how you get a cold and the flu-like symptoms. And, okay, we got an opening here. We're going to take it. Right across Belmont, going south on our mobile. Right in front of me is the Steinman School. That would be the border of the 36th Ward and the 29th Ward. We're going down this street, a lot of potholes. Uh, looks like Fletcher got uh, reserviced at the corner here. Still a lot of the cement got a lot of cracks and grooves in it, so they didn't do a good job here. And coming up to Barry here, this is Steinman School. Alright, we'll catch you on the next video coming around.